What is up guys and welcome back to my channel if you are new here. My name is Katie and you came at a really good time because I have some exciting news. So I keep getting asked the same question over and over again on my Instagram in the comments. Ryan keeps getting asked too when I am getting a new truck or when I am going to build a truck. So my lease is up at the end of May and I decided that I would jump on this opportunity before that and I got a new truck. I think it's time to go outside and show you what I brought home. It could be anything. <laughs> more cranks it might go. <laughs> Holy uh, shit, it started! Uh, oh my god, I can't believe it I can't believe it started either. I know, I said, watch it turn over. For the last, like, two days, we had a jump started twice with two sets of jumper cables off my truck. So, okay, so yesterday, I literally drove it, what, for probably 45 minutes? Yeah. Let it run for, like, another half an hour, and then drove it an hour? Yeah. Left it running and then drove like another 30 minutes. And like an hour and a half later, it wouldn't start. Yeah. Right? Yeah. It's crazy. Why did it start? It's fucking crazy. <laughs> I know. It was cranking fun. Fuck that. It was cranking fine, so that's why I said keep going. That's my other thing is, I mean, first of all, old diesel. Let me just. I know. Oh, I love it. Oh, that sounds so good. I was gonna say your first mod is that seat belt thing will always go off. I forget the combo and I forget if the, the truck I think has to be off. So we'll go for a drive first and then turn off that seat belt chime. Uh, not saying don't do that, but these four, see, is. Really? Did it still so get that turbo? Anyway guys, this is my new truck. It is a 2003 6.0, which is actually the first truck I ever owned was a 2003 King Ranch 6.0. Now this isn't a King Ranch, but oh my God, does it feel good to be back in a diesel. That's my bad. You want me to put the steering wheel over here? <laughs> We're obviously gonna disable the seatbelt track. You're gonna have to turn it off, unfortunately, but fortunately it should start again. We'll be fine. Set the parking brake. Looking at my little cheat sheet down here. So yeah, put that down. Turn, all doors are closed. Driver's safety belt is unbuckled. The parking and headlights are off. Okay, so what you're gonna do is you're gonna turn the ignition on. Do not start. So wherever the seatbelt guy is, wait for him to go off. You're going to buckle and unbuckle your, your seat belt three times leaving it with it unbuckled now now that it went off buckle and unbuckle your seat belt three times okay one again two and three unbuckle turn the headlights on turn them off buckle and unbuckle your seat belt three times I know it seems weird but that's just what you got to do Okay, buckle and unbuckle the seatbelt. That's all you gotta do. So it won't ding all the time now that you're sitting in the seat, but still wear your seatbelt. Yeah, let's try and restart it again. Hopefully she's good. Fire it. Oh, wow. All right, you guys, it is the next day. So it's the middle of April and it's snowing. End of April and it's snowing. Um, look at that. I didn't have much faith that she would start this morning just because we're having uh, some issues with it starting consistently. So yeah, but she started right up, which is absolutely amazing because, well, when you buy a truck, you want it to start. So we got it started. We turned the seatbelt beeper thing off, which I didn't really care about, but I knew he would complain about it. So yeah, I make the men happy, I guess. <laughs> so excited to bring you guys along with this with me to build this thing 
and make it exactly how I want it. I do have a very different taste uh, compared to Ryan and his builds and what he likes, so I'm excited to, you know, switch it up a little bit for you guys. Let me know in the comments down below what you want to see with this build, how maybe what you think I'm going to do with it. We got some exciting stuff coming, and I'm so happy I can finally bring you guys along with me. We're going to make this truck badass. We are going to start changing some stuff and making it better. So I will see you guys in my next video.